This is like the the calm before the storm. And it's over here. They're buttoning it up pretty quick. In the meantime, I have this whole beach to myself. <laughs> it's perfect. You can see most of the businesses have closed up shop. You know, we're still maybe six or seven hours before it starts to get a lot of fun around here. Wow, people are very well prepared days in advance. It's great. So it's things like this here that worry me because that'll just fly and I'll slice through somebody and cut them in half. It's a staging area for a building that they're building next, uh, right next door. Yeah, none of this is gonna survive. We'll see. Even here, they've been coming out here and filling up um, uh, sandbags. Got all of this. This is just random wood, spikes, and glass, and this abandoned car here. So about six hours from now, giant typhoon is going to be coming this way from the Philippines and hitting this beach head on. They've been out here the last couple of days cleaning up, battening down the hatches, taking down a lot of the infrastructure. You can see all the Everything's kind of been put up, stacked up, all the awnings, everything. This this was a very vibrant area, maybe uh, over the weekend, with lots of people, lots of tourists out here. And as you can see, it's they've torn down everything. There was a stage over here that was like a, like a live music stage right on the beach. That's been torn down. You used to have to walk further down that way to get to the water, but this uh, storm surge is gonna come up and engulf this entire beach. There's a couple of surfboards out here, and I have seen surfers out here. You gotta protect the ATMs too, right? <laughs> a hotel that's under construction right now and they're boarding everything up so they don't lose the work they've already put into it uh, it's very interesting that the, the wind is actually going <laughs> towards the east on the tail end it should get uh pretty fun later on because the wind is going in different directions. I have to start going inside soon. Um, they're going to lock it down between uh, pretty much all night. They said don't come back out till about 10 a.m. So right now it's okay, but you can see out there there's something big coming. water from leaking in. I'm trying my best. Over here too, swimming in water. My building did pretty good. It would shake and rattle a little bit in the wind overnight. You can feel it kind of doing this. Of course it's supposed to do that, but it's still scared the shit out of me. It was not a fun night, that's for sure. <laughs> All of this was a boardwalk. pretty normal. I mean, down trees, trash everywhere. But uh, of course, first thing this morning, everyone woke up and started cleaning up right away. It's like normal life. 